Hello Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome cross watchers. I hope you're all having an amazing day today. I'm going to be taking a look and seeing what's manifesting for you all. What's going on right now in your current situation with you, the person on your mind, if any, and what you need to know so whenever you do see this it will be the right time and as always take what resonates and leave out the rest practice using your own discernment as always and don't forget to uh, like comment subscribe follow me on all social media tiktok instagram I am spiritually equally on all platforms and if you're interested in a personal reading done by myself, I will leave all of that information in the description box below for you all with the link to my website spirituallyequally.com for you to take a look and view at all of the different options for readings. All right, so Capricorn, a lot going on with the, the crown, the crown chakra, your connection to the subconscious, your connection to the spirit realm. So pay attention to your dreams. I see a lot going on in your dreams. They're providing rich insight into the issues that are currently playing on your mind right now. So it's I'm hearing reflecting. So there's some sort of mirroring or reflection going on when it comes to your dreams and a personal matter right now and how that matter or situation is making you feel subconsciously. I see... You're really paying attention to your thoughts. Keep your thoughts positive. Move past your limiting beliefs and shift your energy to raise your vibrations, okay? So a new opportunity is being handed to you here. And it's really important to stay positive right now in this moment. Five of Pentacles is some of you are struggling right now, okay? Maybe finances are tight, your feeling a sense of lack but it's it's important to stay positive because good things are coming good things are coming and soon eight of wands this is very very quick moving energy right I, I see a new opportunity coming in and if queen of pentacles here there is this energy of you where you're where you're headed is going to be completely i'm hearing things are going to be completely different than how it is now and this is this moment you're in will change okay you are really headed to resources possession security in your life I'm seeing autumn is coming up. Everything will come together in the fall. So expect change, balance, and reconnecting with loved ones during this time. A lot of stability, a lot of security. And it starts with you. It starts with the boundaries that you keep with yourself. The boundaries that you're enforcing with others as well. So I see you building boundaries and preserving um, better boundaries in order to protect, to protect your thoughts your emotional space, okay, and not letting other people's fears or negativity to keep you stuck. Okay, tell me about this new opportunity coming in for Capricorn. Hmm. Okay. So, could be coming from an air sign, a uh, Libra, Gemini, or an Aquarius. But this new opportunity, I see this is going to be something. 
there's a new seed that I see you really planting with your mind. So it feels like you are really going to be disciplined. Being disciplined with yourself. Planting the seed with being disciplined with your thoughts. Keeping those thoughts positive. Uh, but also moving forward with with a practical intention there's a seed that starts with you it's a seed that starts with your mind and there's this opportunity that comes in because of your 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 thinking patterns okay but money is money is coming in a new commitment is coming in okay after after taking a loss but it's not a loss it's actually going to be a win for you because you're going to be in a better place than you were before. Okay. Yeah, I, I do feel like some of you are just not feeling secure or, or stable right now. But there's... Life is... Life is meant to take risks. Okay. But calculated risks. So there's... This energy of you taking a risk towards something that may seem unconventional. It may seem scary at first. But this is you telling yourself, what if I fly? Instead of, what if I fall? It's, what if I fly? What if it turns out exactly how I, I manifested it to? What if it turns out exactly how I thought it would? I feel like you're taking a risk on yourself here. Starting something completely new. Daring to be different. Creating boundaries and discernment and with yourself. Okay. Yeah, it feels like there's something you just don't see yet. But you're taking that risk. You're taking that risk here. And you're, you're going to learn a lot in the process. Ooh, King of Wands wanted to come out. So you could be taking a risk to making, like, this is you becoming the boss of your own life. Taking charge of your life. Taking the control back into your hands. So you felt like it was taken from you, but you're taking control back into your hands. Okay, you're at this halfway point here. You're halfway, you're already halfway there. You're already halfway there, is what I'm hearing. But there's something I do see you releasing or letting go of. What is this? Okay, that's too much. I'll take the top card. Oh, wow. <laughs> you're no longer going to see that the odds are against you, but you're going to start to see that the odds are actually um, in your favor. The odds are in your favor. It's all about a perspective shift. Instead of seeing it one way, you're seeing life in a completely different lens. There's some sort of dream that you have or something that you're seeing in a dream that I see you taking action towards. If you have someone on your mind right now, let's take a look and see how they're feeling about you. What are they thinking, feeling about the situation? Okay. This is someone who's really holding on to you. Okay. But they... <laughs> It feels like things have gotten comfortable. They're they're trying to hold on to you. But I also get a sense that this there's like some sort of disconnect is what I'm I'm picking up on. Like that you two have just gotten really comfortable with each other. To the point where there's like a disconnect. Hmm. 
and they feel like something needs to happen soon and fast. Oh, I, I'm hearing I need to see you soon. So, like this person wants to see you soon and it feels like a, a make or break situation. Maybe you have gone a while without seeing this person and now they're starting to feel like you're not interested in them or you're, you've rejected them in some way. Communication has been little to none, but this person feels like there needs to be action or communication and soon, otherwise it can things can go downhill from there. They see you as a knight of wands though. So this person is seeing you as maybe you've talked about make, um, travel plans or coming to see each other. Why are they seeing Capricorn as the knight of, okay, the sun and the two of pentacles. Oh, interesting. Some of you, this person feels like you're juggling you're juggling things, you're, you're someone who is really exciting, bring a sense of excitement for them, but they also feel like you're unsure, you're, there's some sort of indecision here, you may be indecisive about how you feel about them, or they're just feeling that way because of, because things have gotten either stagnant or just too comfortable, okay, and for some of you, I see you Maybe that's true. Hangman. Not wanting to move this forward anymore. Or just not... Maybe it's not even them. It's just the, the conditions that you're in right now. Okay. I see you releasing an outcome though. Re like being not attached to... How things turn out with this situation with this person. Leading with your heart, but also not in a rush to not in a rush to, to take things too quickly. Oh, we got two people here. Mm, you have a decision to make. You're you're gonna have to make a decision between two people. Could be an air sign, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, or a fire sign. I mean, fire sign, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, or an air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Someone's, I feel like two people are waiting on you. Two people are waiting to, to they're waiting patiently. Okay. A lot of communication is coming in. <laughs> a lot of it. You're going to get some sort of enlightenment about it. Okay. Things are going to start to come together for you. But it's important that you put yourself first right now. And I see that is what you're doing. Okay. I'm seeing the numbers 8, 5, 12. Those numbers, they could be related to birthdays or special days. I'm seeing the letters T, C, B, D, and A. Those letters could be in your name or someone else's name. But with that said, this is what I'm seeing. If it did resonate, let me know. If you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. I hope that you all have an amazing and blessed rest of your days. Bye.